Alright, so yesterday I was digging through some papers, trying to find some papers, and I came across something that I had been wanting to do for a long time. I actually made a bunch of phone calls about it because I couldn't find any information on the internet about the uh, minor league baseball pension plan. It's nowhere on the internet, and I see guys asking all the time, former minor league guys, um, trying to figure out what the pension, because you know, as a as a minor league baseball player, you know there's some kind of pension, or you've read about it before, like I had, and knew that there was one, but didn't know how how it was structured or anything like that. So I, I actually had been calling some people to find out some information about it. Nobody got back to me. I couldn't find any information online. There was nothing. And while I was looking for some some other papers, not even uh, a part of that, I found uh, an old booklet of my minor league players pension plan all right so I, I got really excited because I wanted to do a video on this because there's no information on the internet so now now we've got some internet uh, information up there on this um, the good news is or the good news was that this is uh, obviously the minor league pension plan but it's only on or after January 1st of 2008 and it's 2010 right now when I'm recording this uh, I don't know when you're watching this but um, so that's only two years that we got and most of the guys are probably gonna be before this or somewhere in the middle and how it works is if you were somewhere in the middle like me played after this date and before January 1st 2008 then you take what you earned in the previous pension and add it to what you earned in this pension so it's uh, you know you're not getting two pensions but you do get both pensions you understand what I'm saying? You're not getting double uh, of a pension plan. You're still getting about the same amount you would as if it would have just stayed the same the whole time. Um, it's just two different plans. Um, anyway, uh, the bad news was that I went through this book and it only talks about this pension plan. So I, I didn't have the information to the other pension plan, the pre-2008. So I was like, oh, I got to find this information because it's not on the internet. And I was about ready to tear apart the house to go looking for it because I knew I read it somewhere. And the very first place I looked, I found the other one. So this is the NUP, the NUPP, Non-Uniformed Personnel uh, Pension Plan for minor league players. And uh, that was a good feeling, finding it first place you look, man. I was ready to go for about an hour digging through stuff. But anyway, so I got the pension plans before that, before 2008 and after January 2008. Um, the, let's talk about after 2008. So 2008 and until I don't know when they're going to change it next. But um, the pension plan is um, you have to you have to be you know to get vested or to be eligible you have to be there for five years. Um, I'm going to leave some information on the website yougoprobaseball.com. More information that you can look at more in depth of the of the actual you know numbers and things like that. I'm not going to go over here on the video because it would take forever. But um, pretty much what you do is if you take, um, there's a certain amount they give you for each level you played at. And you take that and you times it by your years of club service. So say for instance, if you're in double A for three years and you're in, you were in A ball for two years, okay? There's a certain number, uh, actually I'll tell you the numbers. Double A was $18 a month and single A or lower was $14 a month. So three years at double A would be $54. Two years at single A or lower would be $28. You add that up, you have $82, and that's what you're gonna be getting a month when you retire at age 65. You'll get $82 per month. Um, so that's your pension plan. You're not gonna get rich. You're not gonna be rich uh, off this pension plan. By then, $82 will be like, uh, you know nothing um, but now okay so now that is after 2008 now the NUP benefit is pre 2000 January 1st 2008 so be 2007 and before and that one this one's a little harder to calculate because you, it's all kind of crazy stuff I actually like the new pension plan better um, it's just a lot easier to calculate. I guess it doesn't matter. You only get $82 anyway when you retire. Um, 
By the way, in the first pension plan, AAA is uh, $22 a month. AAA is $22 a month. AA $18 a month. A or lower is $14 a month. Now we got for the NUP minor league pension plan, NUP benefit, NUPP benefit, um, you have to get it's 2% times your years of club service times your final average club pay. So let's take exam for example again, five years of service. Um, and you have it, this one you have to find your, your club service, which is crazy. I don't know how they do it. You times your the months that you were playing, and you only have to play one day to be eligible for that month. So if you play a full season, you get six months, and a short season, three months. So if you play five full years, counting your short season, you're going to have, uh, what is that, 27 months. Okay? So that's 27 months. Now you, t you uh, divide that number by 12, and that gives you your years of club service. So it actually comes out, even though you play six seasons, you only come out to, or five seasons, it only comes out to 2.25 years of club service, what they call it, okay? So now you're going to take the, uh, after you do that, you take your club, the average club pay, which is the, you know, your annual salary. Say you're making $10,800, okay? You're going to multiply that by 12 and divide it by 6, okay? So that'll give you 21,600. 21, and what is that? Okay, to find your club pay, you can take the, the salary for the year, you multiply it by 12, divide it by the months of club service for the year, for that year. So it would be six. That's where the six comes in. 10,800, that's your yearly annual pay, times 12, minus it by the, or divide it by the months. So if you only got uh, five months that, that year and only do five, then that's going to be your 21,600 club pay, okay? 21,600. Now you want to find your final average club pay it would be the five years, the five highest paid uh, club pays, okay? So you take, the, and it's also consecutive, so it's, pro, it's usually going to be your last five years, but for some guys it may be different. Then all you do is find the average. Add the 5 up, divide it by 5, and you've got your average, okay? So now you're going to take that average. We're going to go back to the original formula. 2% times your years of club service, which was 2.25 for us, for the example, times your average club pay, let's say it came out to 21,000, 21, okay? So if you do 2% times 2.25 times 21,000, you're going to get $945 a year, which comes out to $78.75 a month. So it's four dollars less than the example we did under the old pension plan, but it's what uh, it's it's harder to calculate and it's four dollars less. So um, whatever, I guess we don't even have to be concerned with it. We just have to know how to file when we get to 65 years of age and retire. Um, either way, we're not going to be rich. Um, and like if you were like me and you split down the middle, played before and after, you know, during that time period. You just take your plan up to this point and do the numbers, and then the post-2008, you, you add what you accrue after after the date. So, And then you just take those two numbers and you add them together. You're not getting a whole pension plan here and a whole pension plan here and then getting double, like I said before. Um, and other than that, if you retire early and you want to take it out early, there's a percentage. They pretty much they rape you on that, man. That I was looking at some of the stuff. Um, on there how, how much they take out if you go early so I guess if you can wait until you're 65 but if you don't want to and they've got all other kinds of things like how to pay you if on a, um, for death death and uh, family and all this other stuff but this is the only information on the internet to find it so if you guys have any questions I have all the information in the books right here so please go to you know contact me or whatever on the website you go pro baseball com and I'll help you out with with whatever I can because I know I've been looking for this stuff for a while and there's there's nothing on the internet so uh, give me a send me a message or whatever if you have any questions I'll help you if I can thanks guys